Welcome to the channel. My name's Aidy and we're on day 13 out of a two week trip. The weather isn't so great. What I've decided to do is do a bit of shopping. I'm waffling now and I promised Ed, hello Ed and Chris, I promised Ed that I'd buy her a reduced price present. I'm not paying full price. Not for you Ed, you get a reduced price. All right, well, thanks for watching. Don't forget to do all that YouTube, resubscribe, share this on your social media, please. And I'll be, did I just gob? I apologize, I hate that. So if I did do that, I'm sorry. I most probably cut that out. Right, no, I won't leave it in. Blah, 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 blah. Right, let's go shopping. I managed to find a parking space dead easy because I parked where it, there was a sign that said compact vehicles only. And I thought, well, it is compact compared to a lorry. So I stuck it in there. That'll do, wouldn't it? That's me pouting while all these other Muppets get wet. Eighty Baby's got the, uh, where the hell's this shop? So let's go and get this Disney character warehouse out of the way, have a look around there. Is that too close? It's too close, Aidy. It's too much Aidy face in the morning. If you're watching it in the morning, good morning. If you're watching it at night, go to bed. Whoa, whoa, the sweetest thing. The sweetest, yeah, there it is. That's nice, that's only $25. Right, Ed, we've got a contender. You might be getting one of them. If it wasn't $15, you'd be getting that. Are there any big t-shirts that I could fit in? There's no order, because it goes XBF. What is E for Ed? No, it doesn't look like you can get one of these, Ed. Is that a wig? Deluxe quality, washable, layer wig, $8. Ed, has you sorted? Oh, Lee from the Lodge guy's got one of them. Thank you, crisps. Chuffed the bits with that layer wig. Oh, what's this? <gasps> I don't know what it is, but it's $12.99. $20 for a bag? Who's that? Yeah. What have we got that'll fit me? A penny. Twenty dollars down for thirty five. No. What's that a key ring? Imagine dragging that around with you for a key ring. Eight dollars. What's this? Star Wars beads. Six ninety nine limited edition. Originally seventeen. Ah, oh, it's a Jack the Pumpkin pin lanyard. Yeah, Droid Depot pin. Yeah. Rise of the Resistance. I'm going to get that. It's my new key ring. iPhone, iPhone. $40 for Thor. Ragnar. You're having a giraffe, mate. Keep looking, keep looking, keep looking. That's only $9. That'll do for a new swimming bag, won't it? It's got a volcano bow with. Hey, it's an Arsenal top. How much are they? $40. That's cool. That's only $15. No, it's nice, $25. That's still cool, though. It's all right if you're a midget or a kid, then that would be perfect for you. Forces with you. I love that. Nope. Lanyard pouch with charm. Four dollars. Hang on, everything down here is pink. Don't do pink. This is all girly stuff, isn't it? Official autograph book. Okay, we'll pay for it. Oh, duh. $135 down to 70. Ella. That's $15, that'd be for Ella. Pirate Princess. 99 cents. In you go. Large pirate sash. 99 cents for that sash. What do you do with that? You put it in the giveaway, eh? That's what you do. Put it in there. And that was over $100. 
I'm not happy with this big long handle on this Epcot bag because it drags on the floor. Ooh, big scary tunnel. I hope Ed loves her wig. What a better present to get someone than a wig. And I've also got a little present there for Gary from the Disney Grown Ups. Just get well soon present. It'll be a reduced present, the same as Ed's. It's no special treatment there, Gaz. I feel like I've been walking around all day and I've walked about 100 yards. Genius. I'm getting loads of looks off ladies. Is it because I'm walking around with this? Or is it my big effeminate Epcot bag? Or is it my natural charm and good looks? Hang on, this air conditioning is having a fit. Off to Walmart now to get the last bits of shopping that I need. Where's the exit? Let me out. Freedom! They can take your iPads and phones off you, but they can never take your freedom. Did I get a ticket? No. Freedom! Goodbye, Ralph Polo, Ralph Lauren. Goodbye, seating area. Waiting area. Right chair. Oh, yes, I like. Up Vineland, I'm sure I come down that way. Just going to Walmart. There's some sort of rave going on at the bottom here. <laughs> oh, I love a rave. <laughs> yeah, baby. I could get one with 80 King of Everything written on it. We're going to have a look around the Disney Cobber in a bit. What is it I'm after? You'll have to speak up. Can you hear me? What am I looking for? Because I'm at the coffee. Joffrey's coffee. They've got donut shop ground coffee. I'm looking, I found the bags right, so I'm looking for Joffrey's to see if they've got that in here. I've got Dunkin' Donuts, coffee, we've got Death Wish, we've got Pete's, we've got Starbucks, we've got McDonald's coffee. Hang on, these pods, they're all pods. They are, so if anyone's coming out here and they've got a pod thing in their room, come down to Walmart. This is what we did when we were in Royal Pacific, wasn't it? And we come and got our own pods. Is there any other kind of coffee you want while I'm in it? Did you want that coffee mate stuff? So no one can hear you, the, the GoPro's not near the thing. Right, what one am I looking for? I'll go through them. French vanilla, hazelnut, sugar-free hazelnut, or caramel latte, or chocolate cream. I'm sure I saw the peppermint one somewhere else. Mm, chocolate cream. Is this to go in coffee? No, no, no. So demanding, so particular about what you want. No, not in here, right? there's no peppermint, so you'll have to go without. Unless you want a different make. They've got hazelnut, cinnamon, French toast. Uh, yes, no. 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 But the peppermint one, you want it. All right, I can go to another shop and have a look if I've got time. There's nothing else. Well, that's enough of this, me staring at this. Pringles, scorching cheddar. I found a peppermint mocha, but I'll have to do it. It's well heavy though. That's a lot lighter. Still be wrong though, wouldn't it? That's the wrong one. This is all pants and socks. This is Disney stuff. It's the year it never happened, isn't it? That's the year that it never happened for anyone. Do you know, it's near enough impossible for me to get hold of 2020 stuff. I've been looking in all the flea markets. Well, you're 1928, you're all right. I look all right now, won't I? Stitch. $13. Oh, there's backpacks and all sorts. Here comes Mickey. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my man, hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Pants, ladies bits, ladies bits. There's a t-shirt just for me. Genius, genius. With genius leggings to go with it. I've still not wore out my Harry Potter ones I've had about five years. Have you ever seen something so great? That's an elf, $20 for an elf onesie. That's just weird. Sunglasses and a Santa hat on an uncooked turkey with no head. Hang on, I've lost my stuff. That's not it. Right, quick, where's my stuff? Oh, I've got to find it. Where's my stuff gone? I no one's taken it. Here we go. <sighs> How much is that? Eleven dollars. Oh, a purse. Great. Oh, come here. Mugs. And oh, key rings. One dollar fifty. Those are Disney pins. Four dollars. I like that one. And that one. Two bucks, 90 years of Mickey. Oh, what's this? Forky key ring. 
filter. That looks quite scary, that. Oh, eight dollars. Shot glasses. Ooh. If you had that in Ogre's Cantina, that would be about 50 quid. And there's a Disney section up there with more t-shirts and stuff in it. And the teddies, the teddies are $23. It's a good day, this, because if I don't go home without this shopping, I'm dead. This weighs a ton, though. That's half my luggage allowance is just on that. I'm not exaggerating, either. You are exaggerating. I know I'm exaggerating. Right, let's get out of here. Well, I've never heard of that before. Mountain Dew. Melon. Oh, can I try some of that and put it on the vlog? Oh, cheers. That'll do. Thank you very much. Well, that's the result. She was lovely. Gingerbread snaps Mountain Dew. The world's gone mad, mad, I tell you. Oh, so heavy in my left arm. It's a good job I'm such a beefcake and I could do this. That extremely attractive lady gave me four cans. I said, can I have one? And she went, you're going home. I'll take loads, honey. I went, oh, yes, please. No, I oh, started the car. I didn't want to do that. That's what I want. I fell asleep in the hot tub, so we were running late. Well, they're going to get on Pandora, ride Dinosaur, ride Everest, watch the show, and then leg it over to Epcot for better luck and salvage what we can this evening. It's six o'clock, so we've got four hours. So we better go in. Right, I've been in it two minutes, back the lightning lane for Everest, so let's get moving. getting straight on we got time to have a look at some more stuff big scary dude that must be a yeti yeah search for the yeti uh -huh. prehistoric giant the gigantopithecus blacking that's a bear more comments about the shirt everyone loves my t-shirts my class members another one who stopped me said i love your t-shirt where'd you get that that's the AD orlando t-shirt that is ghostbusters and dustin's from stranger steve you know where he's from i've said it about a million times attention expedition everest team once on board secure all gear in the cargo bag there we go yeah Ten times better in the dark. That's my favourite. Everest is ten times better. Ten times better in the dark. That's my favourite. That's absolutely brilliant. Better get a move on because I've got to be, oh, I don't know, the other end of the park in 90 seconds. And even I can't walk that fast. Yeah, you can, lady. Oh, cheers. Flight of passage is a 115 minute wait at 10 past seven. Park closes at eight. I think I'm going to poodle off to uh, go and watch the show by the entrance of the tree and then go to Epcot after I've done the riverboat thing. Right, I'm getting the one with no alcohol. Uh, where is it? Uh, Night Blossom. Oh, that looks lush, lush. Let's go and find somewhere to have it. This is the nicest drink in Disney. This for now, I want to make a mess. So let's take this and see what this is like. That is so fit. That's definitely my favorite. Gotta not get brain freeze while I'm doing this. Taste of apple, sour, it's, it's a lot, and lime. It's gorgeous. 
and you have these little ball oh god brain freeze again every time I do something like this I end up getting brain freeze don't have any more don't have any more oh it hurts I can't drink any more, it's, it's giving me a headache. Dark proper. God, that hurts. It's really, really nice. It just hurts. Oh, I can't do that anymore. It's making me want to cry. I'll have the balls. Here's one there. I'll mix it up. There's a ball there. This is the best drink in Disney, even though it hurts. So Tuli's Canteen is it. Just in there where those people are going. And you get this drink from there. Just by the entrance. I'm telling you. That's the best drink. It comes with rum if you want it with rum, but I'm driving so I don't drink. I wanted to get something to eat from going around the world in Epcot. And we've got six minutes to drink this, get over to the Navi boat ride, do that. By the time that finishes, we should hop off that, walk to the front, catch the show, and then leg it to the car, and drive over to Epcot. And we salvage some Disney from today. Right. Let's do this, come on. I might have walked past the ride. This has given me brain freeze about 20 times. Oh, where's this ride? I was walking out of the park then. That's all the normal people wait. Jake Sully, Sully, Jake Sully. Does anybody else fancy that big blue avatar? I did. Well, I've got no shame about it either. All nine foot of her.
we can leg it over to Webcot, watch the fireworks show, hopefully get on Frozen again. Oh, I love Frozen. Where did we park? We parked at the front somewhere. I think we parked. I don't know. I never know. I had a brilliant couple of hours in there. Navi riverboat. That was awesome. Watch out for snakes. 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 Alligators. Snakes. What's even in the grass? You can't trust Florida grass. Don't know what's in it. That's tarmac aid. Stop being scared of the tarmac. Oh, it's a car. Watch out for that. Even driving out here is like the Wild West. Have your wits about you. But as I have many wits, and they're always about me, I think we parked in the VIP spot over here where we weren't supposed to. The reserved section. Anyway, where was I? Car's gonna run me over. Cheers. That Everest was absolutely brilliant. Loved it. Every single second of it. It was 10 times better than doing it in a day. You just scream your head off. You don't know where you're going. It's like Space Mountain, but outdoors. Ish. I loved it. I thought it was brilliant. I'm always doing that in the dark now. Until next time, when I might do it in the day. But even so, the night time's brilliant. It's my favorite. Right, car. I think that's us there. That was a mad rush, but we're here. I got lost. I ended up parked in the middle of nowhere. Oh, hang on a sec. Before we forgot we were in. Right, I legged it back. Legged it back. I legged it here and I got in. Spaceship Earth. Oh, I want to do that. I want to do everything. Uh, what should we do? Spaceship Earth with Japanese or German? Should I do one or the other? I told you it looked like the Death Star. How pretty is that? What we haven't done is Figment, which is over here. Oh, I love Figment. Can't speak. Sleeping in the hot tub's not good for you. I was snoring. The barman came over because I was way over dipping in and out of the water. He said, you're snoring again. I said, oh, sorry. And I didn't feel right when I got out. Had a shower. A cup of coffee and all was good. Yeah, we've got to go and do Figment. And you've got to get that lightning name for Frozen. I love Frozen, but I love Figment. So we're going to do that next. If this, is, this isn't a walk-on, if this is if this is if this is this isn't a walk on, I'd be shocked. All the shocks would be walking out. <laughs> Professor Wayne Slinsky and the Shrinking Gun. Professor Brainerd and Flubber. He's a flubber. And Dr. Nigel Channing and Figment. The most irritating one out of all of these. Not the life of Brian. Figment. vehicles <laughs> hello just the one of us yep all right i'll put you right in number five that puts you right in front of pigment if you want okay thank you to ensure your safe tour of our sensory labs please remain seated with your hands arms feet and legs inside your tour tram keep a watchful eye on your children and um oh, oh yes uh, please don't let your imaginations run wild hey our special drive through open house. I am Dr. Nigel Channing, Chairman of the Imagination Institute. Hello. On your tour, you'll see how the five human senses can help capture your imagination. Oh, oh, can I go too? Absolutely not. Uh, this is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, and I know all about the senses. They're sight, sound, <laughs> smell, I don't want you out of my sight. Out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Figment, you are not to interfere with the tour. Our first stop is the sound lab. We'll begin by testing your hearing with the left ear, right ear. Left, right. What? This is on. Who is this? It's Figment. Figment? I told you not to interfere. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. <laughs> now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here. All aboard. Woo-hoo! Next stop, imagination. For every sound, your ears are hearing a thousand thoughts. Your mind has wings. <laughs> 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 
sure you can see with your eyes, but imagine what you could see if you used your imagination. Follow the bouncing figment. One spark of light can let your fancy. Your mind sees more than what your eyes see. Your sense of sight can make your fancy fly. There's more to sight than meets the eye. a good time to use your imagination, so let the good times roll! Woohoo! You win one cent! Imagination works the best when it's set free. You said it, Doc! Imagination is a blast! Maybe we shouldn't have got in there. There we go. Golf ball, dead star. The upwards waterfall. Oh, it's making me want to go for a wee wee's now. Oh, I gotta go wee wee's. That's gonna be a t-shirt. I gotta go wee wee's.
world culture to the celebration of humanity. It is a place full of wonders. Let's go discover them together. There's a magical new interactive trail to explore where water is alive and waiting to play. journeyed around our world since the beginning of time. Born as rain, falling from the clouds, this water travels to our ocean, where sun and waves send it back to the sky to begin the cycle once again. Everywhere it goes, water is alive with personality, changing form and inviting us to play. That we know this most precious of resources is waiting to share its secrets. planet Sandar. On behalf of all Zandarians, may I say that we are extremely pleased and excited to be coming from our world to your Disney World. At our Zandar exhibition, which we understand will be the first other world showcase pavilion at Epcot, we will Google present more product. This is a critical moment. When Rocket unplugs you! We look forward to meeting you in person on a pavilion opens at Epcot in the near future.
into Mexico and I'm absolutely dying to go for our wibbies right Norway's next door frozen time to go on frozen 75 minutes <laughs>
best fireworks show I've ever seen. And let's do one. that frees up tomorrow night so we could do Universal Studios. Oh, oh. Cheers for coming with us today. Bye bye.